it important, Ellie? It's Lieutenant Escoli. Oh, Alex? A friend of yours wants to talk to you. What? What's going on? Nothing. I just got my butt kicked, that's all. Oh. What? What I mean is I took on Mr. Tuff. And he chewed me up, that's what I mean. Now, hold on. Come over here, come over here. Roar into the phone. What? Give a little roar, like a little roar hurt. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, congratulations, Tiger. I'm proud of you. I appreciate you taking us on such short notice, Dr. Spellner. Can I say no to Molly? <laughs> well, I don't know why you should be able to. I never have. You should see what Stan did for one of my students two years ago. It's just miraculous. Well, what do you think? Should we make him look like Robert Redford? Well, I was thinking more of Jim Garner. How about good old Pat McLaughlin? But Jim Garner's so much prettier. No offense, Pat. I think we should reconstruct McLaughlin. Otherwise, his buddies won't recognize him. I suppose. While you're at it, why don't you take off a couple of years, as you've done for so many? <laughs> right. Mother, have you been holding out on me? Oh. You should be grateful that you have your mother's genes. They're holding up beautifully. Thank heaven. <laughs> All due respect to those people who worked on you before, I think I could take it a few steps further. Want to try? What do you say, handsome? I say you are terrific. Thank you. Can you see Chief Whalen? Oh, can I see Chief Whalen? I would be delighted to see Chief Whalen. Hello, Jesse. Hello. You have an officer McLaughlin's case, aren't you? Yes, sir, I am. I need a psychological profile on him. Anything special? No, no, no procedure. Uh, we may want to retire him soon. What? I said we may want to retire him soon. McLaughlin does not want to be retired. He's putting in a return to duty request. Well, I'm glad to hear that. We have to make every effort to keep the men in if that's what they want. Let's put him on easy duty. He doesn't want a desk job, sir. He wants to go back on the streets. Back to Metro. Metro? You'd be lucky to pull regular duty in time. Metro's out of the question. You haven't seen him, Chief. He's almost back in shape. Psychologically, he's ready. He's a good man. You don't want to lose him. <sighs> he wouldn't be able to take care of himself, let alone back up a partner. We'd like to have a chance to prove to you he can. Yeah, how are you going to do that? He'll take all the tests again. Pistol, endurance, obstacle course. He'll do a hundred sit-ups. He'll run a mile and... I know the tests, Alex. He'll take on any instructor in the academy and put him down. He can do that. Just how long before he's ready? One month. I'm telling you, it's no problem. Okay. I'll give you a month. I get the city to appoint a doctor, he and I will be the judges. You're a wonderful person. I will. Oh, just one more thing. It's not easy playing God.
doing? They're not where they should be. You a lot more work on that? Oh, uh, tell me, I need a lot more work on everything. <laughs> Come on, you're gonna make it. Got my money on you, kid. You've come an awful long way already. Well, you bet I have. I owe it all to you, Doc. Not all of it. Yeah, without you, I'd just be sitting somewhere feeling sorry for myself. Everybody's been rooting for you. Jesse, was this all in the line of duty? You're so serious. Yeah, I'm real serious. Now's not the time for serious. Now's the time for smiles and hope, because you're going to make it. Lemonade, Pat, just the way you like it. Jesse, you might have to add a little sugar. Not me, thanks. Well, how are we doing? Jesse says we're doing just fine. Good. A little while longer, then we can relax, right? Well, Jesse says we should... You know what? I don't really care what Jesse says. All I get all day long is Jesse says, Jesse says, and I'm tired of it. I've had it up to here with Jesse says. Maureen. Maureen, come back here and apologize. <laughs> with him around the clock, and I share his misery, try to help him. And it's like I'm just there while you're the shining. I know, I understand. It's infuriating. But he's reaching out right now. He needs somebody, and he thinks it's me. It's, it's, it's something that uh, sometimes pa patients think they need their doctors more than they need. Well, what am I supposed to be, happy about it? No, you're supposed to start thinking about him, what he needs, what he wants. What he needs, what he wants. It's not only for him, it's for you, or you could destroy your marriage. You seem to be doing a good job of that. You know, I'm giving serious consideration to breaking this dish over your head. If you really love that man, you get out there and be his partner. Either get out there or get out of his way. Obstacle course, push-ups, mile run, took a firing range. I mean, he's doing better. But they don't want a human being. They want Superman. Alex, if you can't pass those tests, you shouldn't be out there in the first place. I mean, no matter how we feel about hey. it personally. Hey, I thought you were in his corner. What happened to his big rooting section all of a sudden? I am still here, and I am still rooting. I know. I know.